Hi guys, hope you all are doing well. So today, as the, as you might have guessed from the title, I'm going to tell you how I use aloe vera gel in my skincare and haircare routine. So I have been using aloe vera gel for the past four years, maybe more than that, and it has been like my go-to product for any kind of skin concern. And I prefer pure aloe vera gel. I have this one from Body Cupid. This is 99%. Pure aloe vera gel and it works well both for skin and hair. What I love the most about it is that it has 99% aloe vera juice and it has no sulfate, no parabens, no nasty chemical stuff which, which makes it one of my favorite aloe vera gels. You get a big 200ml tube and this is priced at Rs 3.99. I'll link everything in the description box if you are interested in buying. This doesn't have a green color because generally aloe vera gel when you even pluck fresh aloe vera from the plant the gel is not green in color so there are no colorants or dry dyes in there it doesn't smell like anything so there are no fragrance in there so this, which makes it really suitable for people who have very sensitive skin like in in fact who have very sensitive scalp like me i have very sensitive skin so how i love to use it first of all i love to use it whenever i come from outside and my after sun exposure when my skin is feeling really irritated I love to apply a thick layer of aloe vera gel on my face and I sit and relax I let it sit and let it dry on my skin for good one to two hours I don't remove it and when I wash my face it just you know whatever product has, has to sink into your skin it has already sunk so whatever is left on the surface you can wipe it off if you want to secondly I love to use it as a mixing base for my dry uh, face scrubs and opters Sometimes I make face scrubs at home by mixing oats and uh, a little bit of honey with the aloe vera gel. Instead of using water, I love using aloe vera gel because this has multiple skin benefits. It's rich in minerals. It has so many good benefits like it, ha it soothes the skin, it reduces dark spots, it reduces dryness, it makes your skin so glowy and so youthful, so plump. So I love using aloe vera gel. It not only hydrates, it evens out your complexion. I have seen aloe vera gel doing wonders for my complexion you can use it as a moisturizer if your skin is very oily and uh, use it daily use it before your makeup it works really well as a primer use use it to set your eyebrows it works really well as an eyebrow gel because it's a gel it dries down and it, your hair will be in place for uh, the entire day and i also like love to use it on my hair in my scalp i apply it i massage it i just let it sit in my scalp for like the entire day it doesn't make my hair greasy or sticky so you can let it dry and then you can go out and you do whatever you want to do with your day because it will not make your hair limp or dry or anything you can even apply a little bit of aloe vera gel on the ends to tame them if your hair is feeling really frizzy also you can use aloe vera gel as a body moisturizer if you want to but uh, i personally use it as a mask as a base to mix my uh, opters and scrubs so thirdly, I love using it as a hair mask, hair pack because I really like how my itchy scalp or my irritated scalp feels really calm after using the aloe vera gel and I have seen a really huge difference. I have personally used aloe vera gel for such a long time that you will always find a tube of aloe vera gel in my refrigerator. I used it almost every other day. So if you have blemishes or if you have uneven skin tone for that matter, use pure aloe vera gel so that your skin gets all the goodness that an aloe vera gel has naturally. Yeah, that's about it. And a lot of you guys wanted to know about my hair care routine. So watch out for my hair care routine. It will be up very soon, most probably next week. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, do not forget to give it a big thumbs up. If you are watching me for the first time, please subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you very, very soon in my next video. Till then, bye.